this damping system do for the driver? It anticipates bumps, explains its creators. This is how it works. The suspension of each wheel is equipped with a pump, which, if necessary, provides additional force on the shock absorber rod. That is, the shock absorbers become active rather than passive elements, so the driver suffers less from problems like side sway. You'll feel like you're on a flying carpet, the manufacturers say. No wonder, since the system's response speed is measured in milliseconds, faster than the blink of an eye. And as a finishing touch, they also offer energy recovery, clearly aiming at the electric car market. Next, one of the key elements of oil and gas production facilities, some power plants and chemical production facilities. In order to prepare gas for transportation by pipeline or to pump it into a storage facility, you need to increase its pressure. And that's exactly what compressors like these are for. These models in particular are manufactured by a German company. They can handle natural, synthetic and mixed gas, delivering up to about 489,000 cubic feet per hour. The design pressure is 28 or 52 bar, with other options available upon request. German experts emphasize high fault tolerance and long service life. And also note, the compressors are suitable for different standards, which means that they can be used even in solid waste landfills. We couldn't find it on the market, so we built it ourselves, explain the creators of this helicopter. The model with the beautiful name Zephyr stands out for its built-in parachute, which sets it apart from similar vehicles. It helps reduce the fall speed and thereby save lives in case of emergency. This is the first helicopter in the world with this feature, according to the website. Let's talk about the characteristics of this vehicle. It is a two-seat model with a cruising speed of 100 miles per hour, designed for a range of 198 miles. Maximum engine power is 241 horsepower, with a service ceiling of about 2.5 miles. We produce the new benchmark for air mobility, the developers believe. What professions can robots replace? The list is huge. Today, we're already getting used to delivery and cleaning robots, and in some places there are even robotic news anchors. Used with virtual and augmented reality, robots can be controlled from anywhere. A prime example is on your screen right now. The designers were very creative. This excavator will solve simple and repetitive tasks. For example, digging some trenches all by itself. And for more complicated tasks, the operator can take control using the remote or through a VR system. In the second case, you can be anywhere in the world and control it with your hand. On top of this, it's equipped with advanced safety systems. If a person appears in the danger zone, the machine stops. And of course, you can also sit in the chair and steer the excavator the old-fashioned way. Since we're talking about robots, it's worth mentioning this mechanical assistant. On your screen is the world's first fully electric and autonomous sweeper. It works 10 times faster than a human and consumes 85% less energy than its competitors. The robot measures 11.5 feet by 7.5 feet and has a top speed of about 6.2 miles per hour. Of course, it moves much slower while cleaning, so one charge provides up to 17 hours of operation. It's already been tested in Finland, in the streets of Helsinki. At night, the robot's quiet, and several sweepers at once can be easily controlled via the online system. However, many are concerned that the authors haven't thought about vandal-proofing the robots. <laughs>